Spirituality is a particular term which actually means a dealing with intuition. In the theistic tradition, the notion of clinging into a word, a certain act is regarded as uh, displeasing to a divine principles. A certain act is regarded as pleasing for the divine whatever. In the tradition of non-theism, however, it is very direct that the case history are not particularly important. What is actually important is here and now. Here and now. Now is definitely now. We try to experience what is available there on the spot. There's no point in thinking that a past did exist that we could have now. This is now. This very moment. This very moment. Nothing mystical, just now, very simple, straightforward. And from that nowness, however, arises a sense of intelligence, always, that you are constantly interacting with the reality one by one, spot by spot, constantly. We actually experience fantastic precision, always. But we are threatened by the now, so we jump to the past or the future. Paying attention to the materials that exist in our life, all these choices take place all the time, but none of them are regarded as bad or good per se. Everything we experience are unconditional experience. They don't come along with the label by saying this is regarded as bad, or this is good, but we experience them, but we don't actually pay heed to them properly. We don't actually regard that as a, that we are going somewhere. We regard that as a hassle, waiting to be dead. Waiting to be dead. Waiting to be dead. Waiting to be dead. That's the problem. And that is not trusting the nowness properly, that what is actual experience now possessed a lot of powerful things. It is so powerful that we can't face it. Therefore, we have to borrow from the past, invite future all the time. And maybe that's why we seek religion. Maybe that's why we march in the street. March in the street. Maybe that's why we complain to the society. To the society. Maybe that's why we vote for the presidents. It's quite ironical. Very funny indeed.